Sister Wives Spoiler Mary Brown smacks Cody with Karma Truth Bomb Dear Loves Welcome to Yusa Drama Please do subscribe my YouTube channel A Sister Wives Spoiler shows Mary Brown smacking Cody Brown with a big Karma Truth Bomb on her way out Unmistakably, Mary is going to have fun as she says goodbye to plural marriage On Sunday, November 24, Sister Wives teases that Mary Brown is cashing in on her severance pay by getting Cody Brown to help her move Cody says, I hope it's a goodwill gesture that will keep us in a good place with each other. Undoubtedly, some of the previews for the next episode have made fans skin crawl. Furthermore, other people are baffled by some of the sneak peeks of Mary and Cody flirting. But the newest spoiler has given fans even more insight into the epic close of Mary's chapter with Cody and plural marriage. During an upcoming Sister Wives spoiler, Mary Brown drops a big karma bomb. The TLC clip shows Mary ecstatic to move on. Meanwhile, Cody expresses having mixed emotions but feeling good about Mary getting on with her life. She says to Cody Brown, Hey, I got a bomb to drop. Cody asserts defensively, There are no more bombs to drop, Mary. She looks at him and says with a huge smile, Do you know what today is? He grumbles slightly but admits he knows what it is. Mary cackles at the inside joke. However, her brother-in-law, Nathan Diltz, is in the dark. He wanted in on Mary's big joke. Begrudgingly, Cody admits, it's our anniversary. However, Mary quickly corrects with glee, it's not anymore. Correspondingly, Nathan ags on the absurdity asking, is that why you wore the Karma shirt? She was sporting a green t-shirt that read, I saw that. Karma, Mary claps back, I mean, Karma's a bitch. Although Sister Wives star, Cody Brown can't help but laugh along with Mary Brown in her newfound humor, he does question her intentions. In a confessional, Cody wonders if it is all out of spite. He says, I wonder if she picked this day on purpose. While Mary is thoroughly enjoying the coincidence, she claims, this was not planned. This was not intentional. Furthermore, telling the producers, today would have been mine and Cody's 33rd anniversary. Even if she didn't coordinate the irony, she finds it hilarious. It's almost like it's God, the universe, whatever, is like, you have done your time move on while mary brown wishes things had gone differently she is embracing her new lease on life in the confessional she adds i'm just laying the cards out on the table this is who i am mary states it doesn't matter anymore we're not married seemingly putting up a front mary tells cody their bed is not really nice and needs to be replaced but in the confessional she admits how much she loved their bedroom set Notably, they bought it together when they moved to Las Vegas and it was the first new set they owned. Admittedly, she has slept alone in it for years and she needs to begin her new phase in life without the attachment to memories with Cody. At that point, she knows she doesn't want to stay single forever and the bed would only be an awkward conversation with her future partner. Sister wives producers love drama and they can go to any extent just for the sake of ratings. This made fans wonder if they were pushing Christine to invite Cody and Robin to her big day. Viewers noticed some shocking clues that clearly hinted at the pressure that Christine might have faced because of the producers. But that's not all. There is a lot more to the story. Christine is all set to spill the tea, and she isn't holding back at all. What is this all about? Was Christine forced to invite Cody and Robin? Why do fans feel so to learn some shocking details about what Christine recently spilled? Sister Wives Season 19 brought Cody and David under the same roof, and viewers witnessed this iconic moment. They attended Gwen's bridal shower together when they were first officially introduced. However, their conversation was really awkward as David mainly maintained eye contact with Robin. Cody was quick to notice, and he talked about it during his confession. This clearly didn't sit well with him, and his face turned red. Moreover, he was in disbelief when he learned that David had already met his grandkids and was close to this. Cody had a blank face when Mike Kelty revealed that Wooly often babysits her kids. This awkward yet dramatic conversation would surely have increased the show's ratings, making the producers crave more. So, did they ask Christine to invite Cody and Robin's sister wives? Star Christine Brown Wooly made it clear that she had no intentions of inviting Cody and Robin to her wedding. She noted that she wouldn't even think of doing this to herself, and there was no chance that she would invite this couple to her big day. After this episode, some Redditors speculated that perhaps the producers were asking Christine to invite Cody and Robin to her wedding. 
This would evidently increase the rating of their show as Cody would watch his ex walking down the aisle right in front of his eyes. The OP stated that they saw Christine saying, you're not going to do that to me. This made them wonder if she was talking about the producers. However, the thread clarified that this could have been a mistake of Facebook closed captioning as well. Several viewers admitted that the producers would have at least asked Christine once to do this. It is clear that they would benefit the most from this drama. This came after fans had already accused the network of using Gwen's wedding to bring Cody and David under the same roof. The franchise's main focus was on David and Cody's interaction, and they hardly paid any heed to Gwen. Hence, there is a fair chance that Christine was asked to do this, but she immediately denied it. Therefore, she didn't invite Mary, Cody, and Robin to her wedding as she didn't want to ruin it at all.